Three years ago, my dad was first diagnosed with heart disease followed by lung cancer. I was devastated because growing up, he was more of a buddy than my dad. I remember on his sick bed, he asked me if my research in DNA could help ease the suffering he and many elderly people face. His words left a strong impression in me, and that's why I decided to study the epigenetics of aging today. Simply put, epigenetic is the study of how our DNA is controlled. Aging is a gradual process that occurs over the course of our lives. When we age, our cellular functions decline because of wear and tear to our DNA, causing it to become unstable and switch on and off when it's not supposed to. This DNA malfunction makes us more vulnerable to many aging-related diseases like cancer, dementia, and heart disease. Here's what gets us excited. We have discovered specific genes in a different living organism that may be responsible for delaying its own aging process. Fruit flies, as strange as it may sound, actually have DNA and bodily functions that are very similar to us. They live on average between 60 to 70 days, which allow us to observe the effects of any genetic manipulations on their lifespan quickly. And so we think, what if we could translate our study of fruit fly DNA into specific strategies to prevent our DNA, human DNA, from malfunctioning? Firstly, by discovering the genes that make us vulnerable to specific diseases. This would enable doctors to better identify higher risk patients and prescribe measures to prevent the disease from even taking place at all. Secondly, by uncovering the mechanism that triggers aging, we could then be able to formulate interventions and regimens to enable individuals to age in a healthier manner. Imagine if one day we can delay the process of aging to an extent where we can live healthy and productive life till the moment we pass away. We are still at the very early phases of our research, but we believe that our research has the potential to make significant impact, especially to countries with aging population. My dad has always been very supportive and his battle with cancer motivates me every single day. I hope that my research will one day change the way we age and make a difference in the lives of all our loved ones. Thank you.